and should have won in the narrow Adobe. Unlucky not to. It was restarted and Freddie Lingwin came out on top that night. Lingwin's actually got a very good record on temporary tracks. Always seems to perform well. Has won in the narrow Adobe on two occasions. He's uh, done the business here, of course, in the past, Freddie. So he knows what it takes. And I would say he's got every chance on the outside. Yeah, absolutely. It's the right place to be now that the track has uh, had a couple of races. And Jack Holder gate two. Smarsnik, although he's now won a race, he hasn't made a start all night. So uh, if Jack Holder can drop it across him and survive the first turn without Freddie rounding him up, who knows? Fancy Freddie here, I really do. Yes. I think the opportunity to slingshot the opposition is there for him. Smarzak off the inside in red, Jack Holder out of gate number two in blue, Martin Vashley, gate number three in white, and Lingren out of the outside in the yellow helmet colour. As you rightly said, four riders in the top five in the World Championship, top two going head to head, Martin Vashelik in third. What a lineup, a fitting lineup to conclude the night here in the Principality. It's been a fabulous night. We had drama last year, the track just didn't behave itself. Very different in 23. Congratulations to Ollie Olsen and his staff. They've done a fine job here to produce a stunning race surface. And as a consequence, we have witnessed some terrific speedway. It's been a Pleasure to be here, and it's been a credit to the sport tonight. Absolutely. Back in Cardiff. Yeah, it's been a super track, super racing, yep. super event, and it's all coming down to this one. Last four laps of the night, then. Who's going to be uh, the winner? Will it be Smarsley? Fancy Freddie on the outside. Here we go, then. Last time, takes her up. Vasilik's made a good start. What a start from That's gate number time. three. What a first turn. Holder and Smarsley. Oh, oh, my goodness. No. Do they stay up there? No, no. Martin Vashley out of gate number three. A stunning performance. Smarsley's gone to the back. Jack Holder hanging on in second place, but look at Lingwood coming on strong in third. Unbelievable opening lap. I don't know how they all stayed on. I've got to see that one again. Here comes Lingwood around the outside. No, door's been shut by Jack Holder. Martin Vashley comfortably out front. I can't see him getting past. I'll tell you what, Jack Holder's putting the pressure on. Yep. Not a disaster for Smarzlik, though, back in fourth place with Lingren in third. One more lap to go, Martin Vasilik looking to pick up his second Grand Prix victory of the year, quite possibly his best performance, particularly when you consider he's come from the worst game. Martin Vasilik wins in the Principality in Cardiff in 23. What a night for him. Smarzlik puts himself on the podium around wow. the last time. What a last gasp move from Smarzlik as well. Never knows when he's beat. Got the better of Lingren. Oh, my goodness. Cracking stuff. What a night of Speedway it is. Many congratulations to that man. He is going to get a medal this year, isn't he? He is going along great guns. Smarzlik's had to work overtime for his rostrum position. Jack Holder. Wow. He's in, agony. He's in absolute agony. He will be second ahead tomorrow, that's for sure. But what an artist be where it is. It belongs to Martin Vasilik. It's been a terrific performance. A stunning start. Can't wait to see it again. Absolutely nailed it. I'll tell you but what, here's yeah. the last yeah, move on yeah. the last corner with Smarslik. Brilliant. From just getting the better of Freddie Lingren. And as a consequence, will extend his lead in the World Championship. <laughs> Frustrating for Freddie Lingren. But a cracking race. I want to see that opening lap again because it was so tight going into turn three on the first lap. It was indeed former teammates, of course, in Gorjov, Smarzlik and uh, Martin Vasilik. Loads of respect between those two. Many congratulations to Jack Holder. That's uh, almost like a win itself, picking up 18 championship points tonight. But that man clearly overjoyed. It's a special place to race. And, of course, it's extra special to win here. And you see the reaction. It's all beginning to sink in now. And Martin Vasilik, at the age of 33, is really beginning to uh, mature like a fine wine. Look at that stunning uh, start from gate three. Yeah, a look at that there from Smarzlik as he lifts, gets the bike under control so quickly. Many other riders couldn't have reacted that quick and that could have resulted in a big, big crash. But Martin Vasilik, we hadn't mentioned him before the race. There, look at that. Whoa. How quickly does he react to get that thing under control? Could have gone horribly wrong. But it's all about Martin Vasilik out front. He's won the big one. He's won at Cardiff. Cracking ride from him. Yeah, and uh, as you rightly say, Bartosz Smarzlik never knows when he's beaten, and he actually passes 
Freddie Lingwin late on in the uh, final here with the yeah, last blast around the outside to deny Freddie Lingwin uh, the 16 points. And Bartosz Marzlik will go away with a 24-point lead in the championship. Fabulous effort from Jack Holder. Miraculous effort, I would suggest, from Jack Holder to finish second here after the injury he sustained back in the World Cup last month. But for Martin Vassilic, this is a special moment. This will live long in the memory. And as I say, he won in Prague, which effectively is his home Grand Prix. He, uh, he won back-to-back -back there. He won the previous year as well. But uh, Vasilik wins in fine style with a stunning start. Jack Holder finishes second here in the Principality. That is a stunning effort. Bartosz Smarzlik miraculously comes through into third place when he wasn't looking like he was going to even make the semi-finals. And Freddie Lingwin, unfortunately, doesn't get on the rostrum here this evening. It's we uh, have Vasilik. done the Principality proud tonight. Yeah. So uh, there are the points handed out for this evening's event. Smar um, uh, Martin Vasilik with 20 points, Jack Holder 18, Smarzlik gets 16, 14 for Freddie. Lambert gets 12, Kim Nielsen will be pleased with 11 points, Patrick Dudek 10, Max Frick on 9. It's all beginning to take shape now, but for Bartosz Smarzlik, two rounds to go, he's in the driving seat. That man there looking like he could potentially pick up bronze. Freddie Lingren looking pretty safe in second place. We'll see the overall championship standings as well, which is uh, going to make uh, interesting reading indeed. Here we go then, 138 for Bartosz Smarzlik, 114 for Lingren, 105 for Vasilik, so all of a sudden looking a little bit more comfortable. Great move by Jack Holder to move into fourth place. Jason Doyle slipping to fifth. Bewley hanging on in sixth place with Lambert in seventh and Leon Madsen in eighth. Ty Wolfenden just slipping back to tenth, and that's tough because he might not be fit to ride in Boyens. May well need a wild card for next year now. Um, Dudek, Janowski disappointing once again. And uh, Anders Thompson on the injury list, of course. And uh, probably won't see him again this year. So uh, we can make our way down to the infield now where Scott Nichols is joined by the winner, Martin Vasilik. Yeah, your winner here in Cardiff's Prince Valley Stadium is Martin Vasilik. Martin, you had the worst gate and you absolutely smashed it. Wow, mate, what an amazing feeling. I'm in seventh heaven now and uh, I'm super happy, so pleased for uh, for this uh, day. I won today and I'm very happy. It is an amazing feeling to win here. Uh, it was always one of my dream uh, since my kids' time when I was watching Grand Prix in the TV, all my idols here winning and uh, in my mind that time was one day I very would like to try it. So today I did it and I'm so happy. Thank you very much uh, to all Crown today. It was amazing and uh, wow, this is it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, that's pretty special. Martin, you made such a good start and all the chaos was behind you. Could you see it on the TV screen, what was happening behind? No, mate, I was so steep off four laps, so uh, I just keep focused and don't make uh, some uh, mistake. And uh, no, I was just keep focused on myself. Well, thanks, mate. I'm really happy for you to go and take your top step. Well done. Thank you very much. Thank you, Cardiff. Well spoke uh, very uh, eloquently there. And Martin Vasilik, the real deal these days. As I say, some of his progress has been halted by injury at times, but uh, he's fully fit this year and he's going along nicely and looking like a, a top three finisher in the World Championship in 2023. Moving along swiftly.